Hey everyone, this is Tony LeBron with Uplift TV and we are here at NRB 2017 in Orlando, Florida and I have with me the two stars and the director of the movie because of Gracia. Oh, you said it right! <laughs> Gracia! Mariah. Yes. yes. <laughs> Gracia, you are the star in the film. Yes. Tell me about your role in the film and tell me about the movie. Yes, so I play Gracia. Um, she is a very strong and central character to the story. She's a girl with convictions. Um, but the thing I love about her is she really represents her name well. She doesn't argue with people just to be right. Um, she's not condescending in what she believes when somebody disagrees. She handles conversations that are typically very sensitive. Um, with such grace and, and such humility and uh, she's a character I aspire to be like in real life. That's good. I was going to yeah. ask you, how does it relate to, to Mariah? Yeah. Gracia, how does Gracia relate to Mariah? Well, I hope it relates to Mariah. I, yeah. I, I, would, I would love that. She's a, she's a great character. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. Tom, tell me a little bit about the inspiration movie. You're the writer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, tell me. Well, I've been a teacher for 27 years. Okay. So I've been working with teenagers pretty much my entire life. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, around 2001, I wrote a play called G Factor, which is based, the movie is based on that. Okay. And what I saw happening was secular humanism was just creeping into the school system. Mm -hmm. Each year, it seemed like it was getting darker and darker. And I felt like the Christian kids were almost like they were walking along the sides of the hallways and I felt like they were becoming almost undercover Christians. Okay. And so I wanted to create a, a story that really resonated with them and would lift them up mm -hmm. and, and help them to have a voice, uh, have, a, have a film that says, hey, you know what, I, I know what I believe and, and get them feeling the convictions outside of school. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Fantastic. Chris, yeah. tell me about this movie and um, how'd you get involved, your character? Yeah, so uh, I've done a little bit of acting and this was uh, the most recent uh, kind of the only faith-friendly film that I've ever done, um, so I'm really proud to be a part of it. I play Chase Morgan in, okay. in the film, and I'm uh, one of those undercover Christians that okay. Tom was talking about, and uh, I fall in love with Gracia, okay. Grace, so yeah. Fantastic. When What's the takeaway you want when somebody watches the film? Well, a couple things. I mean, uh, our demographics are all over the map. Uh, for teenagers, whether it's middle school kids or high school kids, uh, we want them to walk through their hallways uh, not being loud and proud. I mean, what Mariah said is true, being graceful, yeah. but knowing what you believe. Uh, we want them to uh, explore the idea of chastity and courtship in their lives where they're, they're actually believing that they can set their sexual standards here instead of here. Uh, uh, we want the 20-somethings to believe that they can save themselves from marriage, uh, and that uh, they can have good marriages. And for uh, adults that have kids, uh, we want them to watch the film and go, man, you know what, I can, I can help my kids set the bar higher for themselves. I can help them to find their voices, because freedom of speech is another one of the key themes in the film. I love it. Why because of Gracia and not why because of Grace? Because of Gracia. <laughs> man, I love the name of that. Can you say that? Well, it depends on how you want me to say it, because most people have been saying, because of Gracia. <laughs> and then, thankfully, we got Tony over exactly. here saying it because of Gracia. <laughs> I love the way she says it. My knees are weak. Uh, because of Gracia has two meanings. By the way, it's a good question, Tony. Uh, first of all, it's because of God's grace, gra grace, yeah. which Gracia is, because of grace. It changes our lives, and we become more graceful to others. And I believe that we can help people on their journeys to find their relationship with Christ when they see that in our own lives. The other part of it is because of Gracia, the character, yeah. uh, because of the gracefulness she has, she really lifts everyone up around her and she actually has a, a tremendous impact on Chase Morgan. Bobby, a girl who's struggling with her with her own uh, sexual experiences, ends up getting pregnant and Gracia walks through that teen pregnancy with her, but she also impacts her teacher who's an atheist. And she, I believe God's got us on a journey. You know, he might be here, he might be here, he might be here. We've got this one character, uh, Mr. Livingston, who is way over here, but God's calling him quietly. And, Gra and Gracia's testimony is really helping him in his direction. Amazing, so Gracia representing God's grace, and it's what brings us to the cross. Fantastic, grace, God's grace. So good, the movie's because of Gracia. When, are, um, when is it coming out, when, where can we see it? September 15th is uh, when it's coming out. It's got a, It's starting with a limited release. We're going to some big centers across America, 20 cities, and then we're going to cascade and grow it from there. Okay. The movie is Because of Gracia. Be on the lookout and be sure and watch it. Thank you so much for being with Thank us. Thank you. Because Thank of you. Gracia. Yay. Tony, I love it, man. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, man.